Welcome and thanks for joining. In this video, we will show you how to connect your favorite apps to cloudprinter.com via Zapier and enjoy automated global printing in just a few simple steps. Keep in mind that to use our integration, you need to have a registered Zapier in cloudprinter.com accounts. After you have registered, go to cloudprinter.com main page, choose Connected apps in the menu bar and click on Zapier. You can push the Activate Now button to set up ready-to-go Zaps or create your own Zaps. Otherwise, you can go straight to pre-made Zaps here, press the Use List Zap button and get right to setting a specific Zap. If you push the Activate Now button, you will have to fill in the email you use for Zapier and hit the Continue button. Now type your password and press the Continue button. You're invited to use cloudprinter.com on Zapier. To proceed, Push the Accept Invite and Build a Zap button. To start automating your print needs, go to My Apps in the left menu bar and search for cloudprinter.com. Click on the Connect button and fill in your email and password. Then press the Yes Authorize button. Now choose your account and press the Authorize button. At this point, click on this icon to view app info. Now you can connect cloudprinter.com to 2000 apps and automate your global print needs in a few simple steps. Here you can find some ready-to-go Zaps we have created to give you a couple of examples of how you can use cloudprinter.com integration with Zapier. To start using pre-made Zaps, simply click on the Try It button near Zap you would like to apply. For example, you can add new cloudprinter.com signals to your Google spreadsheets with the help of this Zap. Press on the Try It button and you will automatically proceed to Zap setup. First, choose the preferred cloudprinter.com account for the Zap and tap the Continue button. Now, it's time to set up the trigger. A trigger is an event that starts a zap, so choose the signals you would like to receive from cloudprinter.com. You can either choose one specific signal or add all available signals. For example, you would like to receive signals each time your order is validated in your Google Spreadsheets. Now, push the Continue button. Now, you can test your trigger. For this, simply push the Test Trigger button after the system has provided you with an example signal, you can push the Continue button and proceed with the setting up your Google Spreadsheets. Now, you will have to settle the action. For this, you will first have to set the action event. Simply choose the spreadsheet you would like to use for cloudprinter.com signals. You can pick the option that fits you best. For example, you can create a specific spreadsheet for cloudprinter.com signals in advance and choose to create a row in the spreadsheet. When you've made your choice, Press the Continue button. Here, you will have to choose the account from which spreadsheets will be taken and press the Continue button. Then, choose the Google Drive you would like to use, select a specific spreadsheet and define the sheet that will receive signals from cloudprinter.com. Now, set the specs you would like to be added to each particular signal in your spreadsheets. When you set up all signals, press the Continue button. Now, you can test the Zap via pressing the Test and Continue button and hit the Turn on Zap button. You can share the Zap with your colleagues and friends to help them start using Zapier. Check out your spreadsheets to see whether everything is working and enjoy easy process automation. Thank you for watching our self-service course and wait for our next tutorials that are coming soon.